Hello and welcome to Just Tech Solutions. I'm really grateful for the subscriptions and likes. In today's video, I'll be taking you through how to download, install, and configure IP Messenger. Let's get started. IP Messenger is a completely free chat and instant messaging program that allows you to communicate inside local area network. That's your LAN. Sharing of files, for example, image, text or document, etc. Now, let's talk about how to download IP Messenger. Open your browser, for example, Chrome, Firefox, etc. At your search bar, type download IP Messenger and hit enter. When downloading, check out for the stars associated to it and click on it. Click download and wait for it to start downloading and wait for it to finish. Now let's talk about how to install IP Messenger. Open File Explorer and open your local disk C and create a folder and name it IPNG. Now locate where your application you downloaded is located. Run the app as an administrator and change the location by clicking on the modify and locate the drive C where you created the IPMG folder and click on start and wait for it to finish loading. Now let's talk about how to configure IP Messenger. Right click on the icon and click on settings. With that interface, with a basic LAN, that's the local area network settings, type in the name of the staff who will be using the machine. With the group name, type in the branch name, for example, just text solution. At the broadcast segment, you type in the IP address you use at your company. You make sure you type in all the IP addresses so you can be able to see each other. After typing the IP address, you click on the top arrow to add. But when you click on the down arrow, it removes the selected IP. If maybe you typed a wrong IP address, when you are done inserting all your IP addresses, click apply and OK. After you are done with all this, now let's test the application and see how it works. Click on the icon to open the interface, of which you realize you can see the front desk I created. You can have more depending on the users you have in your company. Type in whatever message you want to type and select the user and click send. Whoever you send the message to receives it with a notification of which he or she clicks on it to check the content. Let's reply with an image. Now locate where the image you want to send is. Click on reply on the IP messenger and drag and drop the image you want to send and click send. The person receives it. To access it, click on the image. And with the pop-up menu, you locate where you want to save the image you requested for. So I choose to save it on the desktop and click save. Wait for it to finish downloading. Now you can access it by clicking on execute to preview it. Let's now try sending documents. Same way, locate where the document is and select the staff you want to send the document to. Drag and drop the document, then click send for the person to receive it and execute it, going through the same process. Thanks for watching. I hope you have really learned a lot today. And please don't forget to click on the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet and don't forget to share so others can also get to learn more as you also learn and as i always say practice makes man perfect so keep practicing and don't forget to leave your comments thanks for watching and see you in my next video